It's going to make such a difference to my life to be able to, um, you know, to, to go anywhere, to sit, to be comfortable, um, if I'm in a queue or anything like that. Yeah. I do like coming home to surprises. I found this on the doorstep. Uh, to be fair, my wife did. The woman did take it in. Now, this is for, or should be, for my mother-in-law, but I thought you guys might be interested in this if you know somebody who's a bit frail and a bit elderly and needs a good trolley. So I'm going to unbox it and we'll have a look. I'm going to show you it should come already assembled. Well, so I'm just literally coming from work. So we ordered this last week. They it said it's they're all put together by like one person or hand put together. But it does look a beast. They've got a bit of kind of brake there. Brake stops. Yeah, that puts the back brake on there. And it has a nice, quite deep little pocket there to get into stuff from the back. And then you've got this nice wooden solid board here. Engineering for 25 years. You can take a look at the brakes. So you can see the brakes come on there. I just Got a nice foam grip up on here, and there's a little catch on this side to lock it into place. But you do get a nice big manual. Okay, so if you want to adjust the height, it is set at a factory height, which is probably this is probably all right for my mother-in-law. But you just slide these up and then remove those. bit stiff because it's new and then you can see you've got your holes so you could come up to this height but I'm going to leave it at that height slide those back over out of the way and just put those back in line it up and then push your clips back over to hold it this on the side is where you put your, your, your cane, the walking stick, and then you attach it with the Velcro here. That's a very nice touch. Impress with that. So this clip here is to lock the brake. So you pull your brake in, like so. So up is in the locked position. So if you want to use it as a seat, quite a nice height for me I'm five foot six shrinking fast <laughs> and uh, sorry about my attire but I have just come in from work so these are swivel locks right so you turn your wheel round now it can't swivel like that it can swivel and this goes up across to that so that's that's it it's got a little bit of movement Put your brake off, it will just go straight. There is a little thing, but nothing major. That's really good, actually. If you're going around in a straight line, we will lock that brake on again. And it does come with a couple of two spare. These are for the wheels to hold the wheels on. Not the best instructions because the photos are, it's a photocopy. And for the leading company that has this all trademarked, walkandrest.com, yeah, you'd think they could do better, to be quite honest, because the quality of the trolley is nice. So you have a nice quality trolley. Lauren has come out to join me because it's, it's for Lauren's mum. But for a, quality, a good quality trolley, and that feels really good, really sturdy, get, get your instructions right. It's, it's not hard. 
Yeah, don't send a photocopied photo piece of paper, get it printed. Anyway, I just want to take the measurement of the height off the floor. It's pretty level here, it's not too bad. The seat height's at 21 inches or 530 mil. Seat width is 15. Handle height, this is on the lowest setting, is approximately 880 or an inch and a quarter under three foot. So I hope that gives you some ideas. Now the last thing we'll do is we'll just fold it up just so we can show you, or actually I'll pull the cover back so you can see inside. It is a nicely made trolley. I just oh, get so annoyed when people skimp on the very last bit for the sake of a few quid. It's ridiculous. Anyway, you would undo your, undo your handles, release your brake, and just fold that up like so, and then put your catch back on to hold your frame in the upright position and as you'll notice it will stand upright so it's a really it's a really this is going to do our mum a treat and uh, yeah nice nice little set of features so i hope you found that useful our mum's a, a little bit frail at times and uh, that is a pretty sturdy piece of kit uh, I will put the price up on the site now. There's also be some affiliate links with a small disclaimer. If you do like it, what you see, and you're thinking of purchasing one, if you use our link, it will give our channel a little kickback. It will cost you no more though. It costs you exactly the same, and we get a few pennies, and it is a few pennies from each sale. Okay, so I'm just gonna wheel this round now. Take this in the car. Now we'll say this is not the lightest of trolleys, depending on if you're getting into a vehicle or not. But let's just see how it goes for fitting it into a vehicle. I've been doing some concreting this morning, so let's just get my tools out of the way. But let's see whether I can put it in with one hand. Sorry about the camera, but it goes in our boot all right there. This is a Peugeot 207 Estate, but it's not a massive boot in here. And uh, I, you can lift it with one hand. It's not too bad, but if a lady or a gentleman are a bit frail, it's probably one of those ones that people like to walk with more than that. So we're gonna go and take it down now. Down to mother, she's only just down the road, and we'll pick it up from there. Our mum's 86, so... So she's quite frail. You probably won't think it when you see her. She still drives. And, uh, but she... Occasionally, she has a tumble. So... That's brilliant. Right, and I thought it was be. so what you do, that's it locked in, in, in the position for upright like this. Yeah. Just take that out, yeah, any of them, just push that down. It's as simple as that. Yeah, just push that like that. There's your thing, wow. your seat, so you can and cover it. A break on it. Well, yeah, I'm going to show you that. So then you lock that across, all right. Now that's your brake. All right, and if you want it to lock it in brake, yes, yeah. you pull that up so that, that sits underneath and then it's locked. It's the perfect height as well, isn't it? You've well, I think so. For me, it was. Oh, Steve, that, that is fabulous. I think I could go on holiday with this. It's comfortable, isn't it? It's, it look, my feet don't yeah. touch the floor. It feels so absolutely comfortable and I feel safe. That's good stuff. Well, that's the important thing is feeling no, safe. Yeah. So, yeah, that's fine. Right. And there's loads. Look at the and space you can, in there. And you can get to it if you're behind it. Oh, I see. Like so. so I keep my bag there. So what we want to check is the height for the handle because it can come up if you want it to. Right. Oh, that's the brake, so you just release oh, that. Oh, well, there's a, a thing there, yeah. Yeah, so you just release that. But you do you, how does, no, right, you could don't, right, you pull that for your brake. 
and then you and then pull that up. up that's and then it, you and turn it down and then, yeah. yeah so you can get to your stuff through the bags yeah, you can so have you your purse handbag your handbag there what does it feel like for pushing it does it feel like it should come up a bit or come up a bit yeah the handle because the handle no, is no, movable no if anything it could go down no well, it's on the lowest oh, that well, one but well, what I will show you is this, okay? On the wheels, right? You see how they're they're moving around. Yeah. If you don't want them to to go straight, if you want them to go straight, yeah. flip your wheel around yeah. that way so that that one's at the front. Push that up and that up, and then. That's incredible. So that's probably better for when you're Safety. sitting down, Safety. but for yeah. when you're sitting down. Do you slide wheel it, Tim? You can do. Let me just look, take them back off again. So you're quite happy. Steve, I'm over the moon. Okay, yeah. I want it, this bit here. Yeah. yeah, if you've got your cane, you pop that out, put yeah. the bottom of your cane in that. Velcro there to go around the, this <laughs> bit. No, I know they fall with everything. <laughs> so if you have a little wander with it, just so we can see. That's the important thing. What do you think about the brake? I've forgotten about the brake. Oh, I see. And, and all I do is just... Yeah, just in case you... Like just in case you run around. Where was the lever for the brake? What, to lock it in brake? Yeah. It's just here. Oh, this one. This is all, all... So now it's automatically locked in place. So you could then just come around and have a sit. So you're happy with that? That's very, good. Very happy, yes. Yeah. Now I did find the price out. And also, it was 129, wasn't it? Um, there are some that look on Amazon. There are some that look the same, guys. That is a little bit dearer. Don't be fooled. It's by Walk and Rest. These are the proper company, and it's 129. Okay. It's going to make such a difference to my life to be able to, um, you know, to, to go anywhere, to sit and be comfortable um, if I'm in a queue or anything like that. Yeah, so it's really good. The only good. thing I need to try now is whether I can fold it up, it up and put it in the back of yep. the car. Yeah, okay, so let's have a go at that when, you, when you've when got up. Right, so to fold it, yes. pull that lever up, I'll let you do it. Right, and then I found oh, it goes down, we it? didn't have oh. to, but it, I found just pull that from the front. I better let you do it from the that's it, pull it up, and then if you get the little lever, pull that one back, and look, you, you do have to kind of push it slightly in that way to go behind the thing. That's the weight of it. Now, what do you think about the weight? Because it's not light, is it? It's not light, but what it's I sturdy think, though. I'm I'll get your keys. We're going to give this a try because this. I want to be able to slide it onto the back seat. To the back seat, okay. I'll let you come past. Now, what I was, what I was hoping I could do. Let's just put that in there. Bring it up here like this. Yep. Turn it round. Turn it on its side. Turn it on its side. And then just lift it in. And there we go. Can do it. You can do it. Yeah. But I'll get used to it. Yeah, and you wouldn't normally have that box on the back seat. No, no, no. How about that? Anti Handle's lovely, isn't it? Anti slip grip. Yeah. Which makes you feel safe. Yeah, no, they thought of everything with it. They I'm, really have. They design yeah. everything. And, and having a brake, I wasn't sure if it would have a brake on it. God, I'm sure it That's really good. Okay, right, so you heard it here first. There's a happy customer. 
<laughs> so that's good. Anyway, guys, we'll catch you. And from me and Eileen, we'll catch you in the next one. Bye. Bye for now. Well, I think that's fairly easy to say that my mother-in-law actually is really happy with that. So if she's happy, we're happy because uh, she likes to feel safe and stuff. And she's definitely very active for her age. So absolutely awesome. So a good product. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And uh, if you liked the video and it helped you out, please consider subscribing, hit the like button and tap the notification bell to see when there's other things that uh, I like too. Bye.